All right, so we are transitioning from literary analysis to research. And like most of you have spent a lot of time online, probably just hours and hours. I got my screen report yesterday. It's an insane amount of time online. And I think to myself, I could be using this time in a more productive manner. So the goal of this assignment is to identify your interest, something you're interested in and passionate about, and then also attach it to a more academic approach uh, and learn how to research in a productive manner. So that's the goal. Step one, I'm going to think about my interest. So I have a handful of interest. You know, I ended up becoming an English teacher. So I'm interested in books, of course. I know this sounds super lame, but I've been listening to a handful of Shakespeare's plays and reading some commentary about his life. <laughs> that was wild. Uh, what else? What else? Um, shoes. You know, I've been following StockX a little bit and seeing how the prices around a handful of shoes have been going up and down and fluctuating, just kind of depending on uh, circumstance. Uh, I, I really like rap music. Spend a lot of time with that. Technology, for the most part, is always really interesting to me. Um, London. I went to London a couple of years back. And absolutely love the city. It was fascinating. I would love to go back. So definitely interested in London. Um, I like poetry. Kind of goes along with the books. Minimalism. As it relates to architecture and design. Okay. All right. So that's a handful. That's enough. Next question. What do I already know a great deal about? So, I mean, I, I know a lot about English language, of course. I have a bachelor's degree uh, with an emphasis in American literature and did a lot of stuff with the British literature as well. So, but personally, I like spending my time reading about rapper and rap music in general. So those two. Now, what would I like to know more about? Earlier this year, a lot of my students spent a lot of time talking about this rapper, NBA young boy. I've had students talking about him for the past couple of years. Um, so much so that I'm, I'm interested in learning more about him as a rapper uh, and just his career in general. Now, also, in tandem with that, uh, the baby has been real popular and they have they've had similar success. I feel like in the past within the past year, within the past 12 months, now, NBA young boy was a little bit more underground for a while and then it's definitely become more commercial. More people are aware of him. My question is, who's better? As somebody who doesn't necessarily listen to both of these rappers um, very often, that would be what I would want to know more about. So I really need to think about what it would take for me to understand an older person trying to figure out who's better. You probably already have your gut visceral reaction if you're into rap music, uh, but I'm not, I'm not certain. So I'm going to compare the two. The first thing I'm going to put is be a young boy on this side, not for any particular reason, just because I wrote his name first. Uh, never broke again, yeah. And then on the right side, I'm going to focus on the baby. They recently put out a new song together. The baby dropped a new album, and which is great. So I can actually do a side by side comparison to see who. Um, did a better job on their verse and overall. All right. So what are some things I need to think about? What do I want to know? How can I compare these things? What questions can I ask? What information can I collect? And what can I, what can I search for on Google? Of course, I'm going to, I'm going to pay attention to credible sources. So this was helpful to get me started. I don't need your charity. I'm going to come up with my own questions. So I'm going to delete these. I'm going to fill out most of this form. Let's get started. Okay. All right. Um, who has bigger hits? Right. Who has sold the most records? Um, what are other questions so I can determine like who's a who's a I don't know I don't know about better rapper. Who is a 
better rapper. I'm be, being a better rapper is made up of a lot of different things, lyrics, uh, melodies, um, cadence, delivery, vocal inflection. So I don't know if any of those can be determined objectively, meaning if I can actually find data to back that up. I think all of it's going to be subjective, meaning it's just going to end up being my opinion. So I don't know if that's a great question. It's a great question, but I don't know if that's a question that I can find an answer to online. I think that's just going to be a personal preference. But right now, I'm just brainstorming. I'm not afraid to put questions on the page. Um, who played more festivals? Right? Like who's being booked more? Uh, who uh, was featured more? Like who got more features? How much does each rapper charge for a feature? I misspelled a lot of those words, but it's okay. My computer's running real slow. So those are some things to think about. What else? What else? Um, how long has each rapper been on the charts? Cool. All right. So my computer froze for the most part, but what I would continue to do is I'm going to continue to ask questions and I'm going to fill up as many of these, ask 10, 15, 20 questions. Uh, and I, I had a discussion with another teacher earlier about this concept and this idea. I think um, everything just popped up because my internet's running really slow. I'm going to erase these. Okay, cool. So, um, billboard hits. Maybe even I can even possibly check the Forbes list and see who's made more money. Now, what else? Like arenas, size, like what size of venues are they playing at? That's going to kind of give me an idea of who's a bigger star. If the baby's playing at local places and NBA Young Boys selling out arenas, that's going to kind of give me an idea of who uh, is a bigger rapper. Okay. Now, draft research question. What I'm going to look at the questions that I've asked, and out of those questions, they lead me to what question like i need to ask a bigger question let me see who has a bigger social media following that's a good question now all of these questions make me think about who's a bigger artist right that's that's really what i want to know is like who's the bigger artist and then more than that, since both of them are could probably care less about being artists and entertainers and things of that nature, but are very interested in money, I think a research question worth asking that would be worth debating and having a conversation about it that would be more than just, I like the baby better than NBA young boy, is who will become a billionaire first? a while for that to pop on the screen because my computer's lagging but i think that's what i want my research question to be is who's going to be a billionaire first because what that all what will force me to figure out is like who's making more money and just because they're making more money right now doesn't mean that they're going to be making more money in the future whoever puts out music that's going to last over the next 10 years 15 years is probably going to be more on track to becoming a billionaire than somebody who's putting out songs that are only popular for a moment. Also, catalog's important. Who Who's putting out more music? Because if you're putting out more music, then you're gonna get more streams. If you're getting more streams, there's the chance of you getting more um, cash flow in return. So I think this is a worthwhile research question when it comes to two up and coming and established rappers. Uh, who's gonna be a billionaire first? So these are the questions that I would go out and I would ask myself and I would try to come up with 10 or 15 more. And then I would begin, I think next week, we're going to have you go out and find answers to the questions that you've created. Hopefully this was helpful. The goal of today's lesson is to brainstorm. 
I want to narrow down what I want my big research question to be. Initially, it was who's a better rapper. I don't think you can figure that out using the internet or a database. I think that's very much subjective. But I think who will become a billionaire first? I th that's something that I can find facts around. Um, Jay-Z's got this great line. He says, men lie, women lie, the numbers don't. So I can go out and find numbers to support this. So that's the plan.